Hello guys, my name is James Nerd and today we are watching Hyundai Xter. There is its type uh, daytime running lamps which means it's a hatchback. And there is square shaped housing for projector headlamps. The front indicators are housed inside the HDRL. You can also see roof rails. Xter has a nice back which has shaped tail lights and halogen indicator light and also skid plates both front and back. There is also spanner shaped 15 inch alloy wheels top model. Coming to Hyundai Inter, you can see similarity like i10 Neos. Same, everything is same. 8 inch touchscreen and uh, digital cockpit. 3 spoke steering wheel with buttons. Fabric seats without adjustable headrest in the front. In the rear, you have fabric seats with adjustable headrests and three-point seat belts for all three seats. Now, when we look at from the side, you can see round AC vents in the front and you also have AC vents in the back. You can see wireless charging pads, USB-A and USB-C ports in the front, rear AC vents and also a 12 volt charger, both front and back. Six airbags, ABS with TBD. Infotainment system is a 18th unit which was used in Hyundai Aura before. It also has Blue Link connectivity system, mood changing music and so on. Fully digital driver's display with steering mounted control. It also has cruise control, tire pressure monitor, brake assist, hill start assist, reverse camera with sensor, stability control, dash cam with dual camera. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto Automatic Climate Control Alexa Connectivity Voice Commands to Control Sunroof Now we come to the engine. There are two engine options. First one is 1.2 liter Kappa petrol engine which produces 83 horsepower and 140 Nm of torque. It can be got with 5 speed manual or 5 speed AMT. One more is 1.2 liter CNG petrol engine which produces 69 horsepower and 95 newton meters of torque. Finally the price. The EX variant starts from 5.99 lakh X showroom. It goes all the way up to 9.99 lakh for SXO connect variant. Can Hyundai extra punch its way to the top of the segment? we have to see in coming months. It's a very good looking hatchback with a ground clearance of 185 mm. The Hyundai Exter reminds me of Dexter. Short and intelligent with square face. Thank you.